What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on the JK Pokemon channel. My name is Reverse Josh and today we're opening up the big kahuna of Twilight Masquerade and that is of course the Elite Trainer Box. Yes, Reverse Josh is back opening an Elite Trainer Box on the channel. It's been a bit since we did one of these. It's been since the release of Temporal Forces that we've had an Elite Trainer Box to open. Uh, this is the newest one for Twilight Masquerade. Look at this. It's got this uh, really shiny holographic uh, Ogre Pond on the front. Very, very cool. And the logo up here and everything is very cool. Uh, holographicness on the side there as well for the Twilight Masquerade set. Here's the back, of course. You guys already kind of know what's going on in these ETBs. I don't want to go too, too deep into to all this on the back here uh, but you guys know the deal we got nine packs we got the promo card we got 65 sleeves all the energy cards uh, players guide the dice the coin flip die the condition markers the whole, the whole box and a code card for the TCG live so I don't want to waste any time like really going over this too much we've opened enough Twilight Masquerade already and we're kind of ending it all here with this elite trainer box this is kind of the big product for the new release wave and everything so Wanted to save this guy for last. Get that plastic off of there and go ahead and slide this out. We'll get rid of the cardboard over there and uh, we'll shove the box in the back for a second as we take a look through the player's guide here. Look at that. Ogre Pond on the front. Uh, I'm just going to kind of skim through this here. You know, we've got some of the cards here. We've, we've seen some of these already as we've opened, like I said, a bunch of this stuff already. But... Just wanted to take a look for some of the new folks who haven't seen what these ETBs are like yet. Um, every single one of these comes with this and shows you off uh, all the cards in the set and kind of what you can do with them. And then of course gives you a full checklist of cards so you can check off everything you buy. Let's go ahead and get into the interesting part here. The box itself, take off the top here and this cardboard insert, which uh, looks pretty cool actually. The design on there is pretty neat. If I do say so myself. Uh, let's see, where do we start? All right. Got, of course, our nine packs here of Twilight Masquerade. We'll stick those off to the side, though. Uh, and take a look at this guy here. Look at this. This is our Teal Mask Ogre Pond promo card here. Really, really like these ETB promos. These are always awesome and so beautiful. Like, I really like that they're doing them as these Illustrator Rare cards as opposed to, like, just making it a fancy little hollow promo or something like that. This is a really cool one though. Like I really like the little detail there of Ogre Pond running through the forest. This just looks like such a fun little card and the artwork is super, super cool. Um, go ahead and take this out of the packaging here so we can get a little bit of a closer look. Look at that. It's so like sparkly and everything. This is such a cool card. Very, very unique. I'm, it seems like they took a lot of time putting this one together for us, so I really appreciate that. I'm still in my quest to collect all the ETB promos from the Scarlet and Violet Wave, so this is a welcome addition to the collection there. We're going to put them off to the side as we kind of go through the rest of what's in here. Uh, poison and burn markers, usual. They're cheap plastic. Nothing too interesting. Uh, dice here. Um, Looks like we got a blue die there, uh, which I can't see the EX logo, so we'll pop it out. But the other uh, damage counter dice, those are the same usual cloudy blue and gray ones, although they don't look as, like, mixed up as they usually are. These are a little more solid in my thing, and they're also missing some white paint on that one there. Interesting. Uh, kind of got a lazy set here. Here is the main die. This is the uh, coin flip die. It's got this cool blue pattern here with all the pearly uh, sparkles and glitter and everything in there. Uh, same usual design. Got the EX logo on there. Nothing too different than all the other ones we have, but really like taking a look at these every once in a while because they are pretty cool. I do like my dice. Usual stack of energy cards there. Don't really need those today. Code card for you. There you go. Take it. Leave it. I don't know what you want to do with it. Here we go. Here's the sleeves. We'll go ahead and pop one of these out real quick and take a look. All right, look at that. Kind of the usual sleeves. I do like the design on this one for the Ogre Pond there. It looks really cool. Got a little crystal in his head there for the mask and everything. Um, but they do have this like really thick, like you can't even see my finger through that. Like I really don't like using these. So we're gonna put those off to the side and use our penny sleeves for today. Here are the uh, dividers here, which are very shiny as you can tell there. Let's see what's on the back here. We got the full Ogre Pond and the close-up. So this one's not too interesting compared to some of the other ones we've gotten in the past. Uh, it's just got the same artwork of Ogre Pond on it, but you know, these are just fun little extra additions. They don't have to throw these in for us, but this box is a great value and I'm glad that they include that because those dividers are nice for storage and whatnot. So yeah, 
All right, it's now time to open our nine packs here of Twilight Masquerade. Let's see what all the packs are we got here. What's our extra? We got Dragapult, uh, Sinistra, Ursaluna, Ogre Pun, Dragapult. There we go. All right, so we got three Ursaluna packs. We'll save the Ursalunas for last today. And we'll go ahead and kick things off as we have been. First pack of our ETB today. Let's go ahead and see what we got in this bad boy. All right, code card for you. Let's do a guess energy. Let's do a grass energy for our Ogre Pond there. We got a psychic one. All right. All right, let's see what we get in pack number one. Glimmit. Thwacky, Heliolisk, Amolga, Sunflora, Boomerang Energy, Ryfort, Lucian Reverse, Chimchar Reverse, and a Zapdos. Holographic. Pretty cool artwork there on that Zapdos. Pack number two. Let's see what we can get. Really hoping for some good pulls today. Definitely want that Perrin, the Growlithe, to go with it. Uh, let's do a Guest Energy real quick. Let's do Fire for that Growlithe. We got a Dark type Energy. All right. Um, but yeah, I want to get maybe that Greninja, that would be cool. Um, I don't know what else. Uh, that Ursaluna, any Ursaluna cards would be very cool. There's Perrin speaking of her. Oh my gosh, and look at that. We got the Unfair Stamp a spec card. Wow, look at that. We already have this card, but it is a welcome addition to the collection nonetheless. Definitely can trade this for something else. Um, very exciting there. Uh, we got a Swirlix Reverse and a Pheasantipity Holographic. Pack number three. Let's see what we get here. Sinistra, what do you have for us today? Let's go for the code here. That's the code, not the energy. We'll go for a lightning steel type energy. All right. Chimchar, Whirlipede, Crawdaunt, Farfetched, Brute Bonnet, Ambipom, Bug Catching Set, Whirlipede Reversed, Palisand Reversed, and Illusion Full Art. Oh my gosh, we got this in the Japanese set. Uh, this was super, super sick. We got this in the Crimson Haze booster box in Japanese. So now we have it here in English. Very, very cool. Pack number four. Let's see here. All right. Code for you there. Let's do a fire energy, maybe? We got a water one. All right. We are not doing good at this. We never do. Uh, but let's see. Illumise, Applin, Nosepass, Sea King, Revavroom, Florges, Festival Grounds, Diplin, Reverse, Sand Slash, Reverse, and a Walking Wake holographic there. Ancient Pokemon holographic. Looks pretty cool there. All right. On to the Ogre Pond pack here. We are halfway through. Ogre Pond, don't let us down. We've already got two hits. Let's see what you got for us today. There's a code for you. It's the grass type energy. We got a dark type one. So far, O for O. O for five on these guess the energies, but uh, Torkoal, Halucha, Kadabra, Tangrowth, Agron, Clefable, The Cook, Cooking It Up, Lana's Aid, Heatran Reverse, which we know is a holographic in this set, and a Hisuian Arcanine. Next pack, another Ogre Pond pack. Let's see if Ogre Pond can do something for us since we got the promo that back there. We've got the box. Uh, let's do a Psychic Energy. We got a Fighting one. All right. Sunkern, Abra, Snow Runt, Chimeco, Glamora, Polyrath, Hassel, Volbeat, Fair Giraffe Reverse, and a Blood Moon. Ursa Luna EX. Look at that. We're pulling everything that we pulled in the Crimson Haze box. I swear. I think I've pulled almost everything. Speaking of Ursa Luna, we've got all three of Ursa Luna's packs here left. So hopefully we've got maybe one more card. We're doing pretty good though so far. Uh, every other pack basically we are pulling something. So let's see. We can maybe have one or two more things in here if we're lucky. Uh, let's guess the energy. Let's do a fighting energy for our Ursa Luna there. It's a water one. We are doing very, very bad at this. Corfish, Grookey, Helioptile, Finizen, Tatsugiri, Diplin, Jamming Tower, Kirin Reverse, Okie Dogi Reverse, which is a rare holographic in this set, and another Hisuian Arcanine. All right. Second to last pack. Let's see what we got in here. Uh, We've got to pull at least one more thing here, I think, to make this box really the best Ogre Pond ETB of all time. Let's go for a Grass Energy, and it's a Lightning one. All right, let's see what kind of banger we get in here. Ducklet, Growlithe, Monferno, Nosepass, Palafin, Chiyu, Lucky Helmet, Cramorant. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just said that. We just, we just got the Carmine 
uh, special illustrator rare card. This is one of the rarest cards in the set. Holy shit. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe we just pulled this. This is the SIR Carmine. Uh, this was not planned. I did not uh, fake these packs. I got this on TikTok shop. Wow, very, very cool pull there. Very exciting. Uh, we got the Enamorous on the back there, but oh my gosh, this is definitely now the best uh, ETB of all time. Look at that. We got the Carmine Illustrator Rare there. Very, very cool. Let's check the back real quick because this is a very uh, special card here. It looks pretty good. It's a little bit off center, but not too, too bad. Wow. Uh, pull of the century right there. Very, very cool. Uh, and we still have one final pack to go. So let's see if this final Ursaluna pack can give us anything. Uh, wow, what a pull. Our pulls have been kind of lacking in Twilight Masquerade, but I guess because it was, was being saved for that Carmine right there. But uh, here's the code for you guys. And uh, let's do a dark energy maybe, and we get a fire one. All right, so we didn't get any of these right, but uh, all right. Corfish, Grookey, Finizen, Watrol, Diplin, Cramorant, Kirin, Venipede Reverse, Jinx Reverse, and an Alakazam Holographic. That's actually a pretty cool card there. But, uh, oh my gosh. This was quite the uh, ETB opening today. Let's do a quick little recap here of everything we pulled. Uh, yeah, let's do it like this. All right. So first and foremost, obviously, we got our Teal Mask Ogre Pond, a promo card, very cool card there. Glad to have this one in the ETB promo collection. We got the Unfair Stamp A-Spec card, a duplicate that we do already have, but nonetheless, it is an A-Spec, so it's a great pull uh, for us. Then, of course, we got the Blood Moon Ursaluna EX, a fan favorite Pokemon of mine. Very excited to have this in English now. Like I said, I think I have almost all my cards from the Blood from the uh, Crimson Haze box now in English. So very, very cool to have this one. Uh, excited to add him to the collection. Then, of course, we got Lucian, another full art trainer. Very, very cool. Uh, again, have him in Japanese as well. So excited to have him here in the English variety. And then, of course, we got the S-I-R Carmine uh, Illustrator Rare here. This is such a freaking cool card. Uh, this is one of the few SIRs in this set, so I'm very excited to have this one. Uh, wow, yeah, what a pull here uh, and what a box. So uh, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe down below for more Twilight Masquerade content. That's going to be it for the rest of this video. And uh, until the next time, keep on catching, training, battling, and uh, yeah, peace out, Carmine.